welcome back to Dismantled Bittersweet Misery, or just the expansion. We're gonna roll out continuing where we left off of uh, killing everything and going to the second floor. Eh, th that's just about it. I gotta kill everything. I must kill everything. It is what's demanded of me. Butcher everything. Mmm. Also have some good news. Okay. Alright. You ready? You ready for it? I ordered McDonald's, right? Okay. I ordered McDonald's. Here's some evidence, okay? Here, here's McDonald's and fries, okay? But... Nom. But that's not the good part. I ordered medium fries. And a bunch of burgers. And they gave me... They gave me two of these. I only learned to need one. They gave me two buckets, or I don't even know what the fuck you'd call this cup. Is this called a cup? A bucket? A cup? Batch? I don't even know what the fuck to call the cardboard design. But uh, I ordered one of those fries. They gave me two containers of fries. Oh, isn't that just good luck? Got double the amount of fries. I love fries. It's delicious. So I'm loaded on carbs <laughs> and coffee. The best things in life. All right, now. Fuck. Nope, this is problematic. Caution, as expected. I'm wasting shotgun shells, but uh, let's just say it's needed for the time being. Come on. What'd you got? Oh, never mind. Nice. Oh. I fucking hate these guys. I never liked them. Oh, jeez. <sighs> Surprising. They do a lot of damage. And I won't forgive them for, like, end game. For those, of course, that watched my previous videos and going through the caves, they were an absolute pain in so many ways. <laughs> oh boy, were they. Mm. Yeah, I, I didn't like how many there were, and they were just everywhere. bear noises. I can return the dialect of the grunting noise. Ah, oh, fuck. No. Don't want to waste my fucking shotgun ammo. Fuck off. Jabbing these things... Huh? Jabbing these things with a knife would be definitely disgusting in real life. Here and in there. I gotta be careful. Yep. Wasting my shotgun ammo, you piece of shit. Ah, eh, five bullets. Hm, no. Let's see if we get some more stuff. Oh, no. Or maybe. No. Hmm, that's a shame. Hmm. Yeah. Hear more of the gas mash noises. Either way. Let's just try not to melt to death, because then that would mean having to restart my save from where are we? Uh, started. Mm. Fuck. Flinched. Mm. Oh, Jesus Christ! 
was expecting that, but the indecisiveness, Jesus Christ, makes it unpredictable. Oh God, this, that big booty. No, no. Jesus Christ. Okay. Four shots. It's like Canadian Maple Leaf now. Nice. More shotgun ammo. Can't wait to get the Tommy gun though. That shit was nice. Hmm. Well, at least this area is clear out. Or cleared out. So I should turn this up a little bit. Yoink. The funny thing though, at least in terms of real world logic with this map is like, technically I as the character from the main game would have cleaned out this place. I mean, he could have hidden more experiments, sure, but all the ammo and the health that I'd have picked up. It, it would mean the dude, Spencer, whoever the fuck, organized all this and released more monsters or whatever, let's say. He also scattered ammo and health around the entire asylum all over again. Like he's the fucking Easter Bunny, just like, sort of like, or more ha like Halloween, you know, grabs a bucket of chocolate, just dashes it in this room, in this room, in this room. It's like a mix of Halloween and the Easter Bunny. Where it's like, you know, with Easter, it's related simply because you're hunting for the Easter chocolates, but Halloween because globs and globs of chocolate throwing around everywhere. Oh, wait, that's the shotgun one. Gotta be careful. But yeah, I don't know, it's kind of strange for the doctor or whomever to uh, litter the asylum with ammo and goodies to be rediscovered. Stand. Stay him. Yoinks. Doggos. Ah, oh, fuck. No. Of course, these fucks have to come at the same time. I fucking hate when they mix us two. Okay, so puzzle's still solved. Let's see if there's anything in these vents, and if it's easier to jump in here. This was a pain before. Still is. Yeah, fuck it. Try it over and over. I, I just don't like the jumping. Uh, let's see. Guess we can go this way. This was a dead end area before. Boxes. Different. Huh? Nope. Fuck off. Hm. Oh, last mount oh, shit. Three, fuck, I need more ammo. Hmm, box is blocking my way though. Interesting. Oh, I don't like the concept. Nope. Nope, never mind. Just a Tupperware container or whatever the fuck those are. Oh, a save room. 
Hmm. Well, I guess I won't complain. Ugh. Uh, I have six saves. Might as well use it, I whatever. Absolutely careful. Well, we made it on the other side of the door. Another one? Okay, we'll go over there maybe later. Hmm, you know what? Yeah, we'll do it now. Like I said, it's the dead end area unless the thing unless the place has changed. Hello. Oh, kidding me. Ammo, please. For the love of God. Really? Fuck you, chair. No ammo. Fuck me. Um, unless there's ammo in there. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And the fire just has to be exactly where the fuck I was. Great. Fantastic. Fantastic. It sprayed fire perfectly. We're at the right prior to the fucking door. Fantastic. Come on. Guess I'll have to skip a little bit, though. Alright, back here. With a little bit more ammo. But there, oh, there's more of them, though. Oh, dogs. Come on. <laughs> Fuck you, dogs. Two slashes, not bad. Mm, more doggos. Fuck. Alright, never mind. Need to find somewhere else, because I need ammo. Fuck me. I found two pistol boxes, hopefully that'll hold me off. Having already faced these guys and so many of them. Problematic, but... Way over there. Come on. Oh. Nice. Thank you. Killed a bunch of doggos. Jeez. Alright, let's hope for some ammo. Yay! And not cougar ladies. I, I don't want to deal with cougar ladies in these tight, tight, tight corridors. A bomb. Ooh! A bomb to blow something up with. Interesting. For the caves, maybe. Oh, she startled me. Stupid fucking dog. But, uh, no, seriously, the bomb. I wonder if it'll be used in the cave where the uh, weird, deformed, gigantic amalgamation boss thing was. That looked like uh, Alf.
Hmm. Surprising. I don't know if, I, if there's any enemies over there. I think I'd hear them breathing. Oh, hello. At least we found a key. That'll be useful for somewhere else. Motherfucker. Now, the question is, what kind of key? Hmm. Mm, okay, no idea. It's not my inventory. Oh, wait, nope. It's just very... Camouflage. An old key. There's some hair stuck. Gross. Hair stuck on a key. Gross. Very gross. Uh, very gross. At least there's no more noise that coming from this vent of the dog making noise. No god! No 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 no! Oh god! Fuck me! That probably. Uh, almost killed me. I thought that did more damage than it really did. Oh, that made me paranoid. I was getting stuck. Fuck. Oh, jeez. Come here. Now, let's leave. Oh, wait. We're fine. We're fine. Oh, okay. Oh, oh God. I mean, I'm not gonna risk, you know, being fine one second and not the next. So. We're Jesus. Yeah, now we're not fine, like I was uh, saying. Fine one second, not fine the next. They jump around everywhere. Oh, annoying. Jesus Christ. Annoying fuckers. I'm taking way too much of my health. Alright, well, if I go this way, it's a dead-end area too, but I'm gonna suspect... Possibly a lot of pain in the ass enemies, since there's a lot of corners. So I see fucking... Jaguar Cougar ladies, or whatever the fuck they are. I have no ammo for anything. Problematic. I want ammo. They made the expansion probably harder. Especially for ammo conservation. Well, if we could just go up. Don't know what I picked up. If I could get in here, if I could get the chainsaw. Just jumping has always been a pain in the ass in this. Either that or these vents can't be accessed anymore and they're just invisible walled. Because I swear I'd have a lot... I, I swear I shouldn't be that shitty with jumping in the vents with the, like, jump crouch. I really can't see myself being that shitty. But I haven't made any vent jumps. Maybe they're just blocked off. Oh, we have the key for this. What? Picture of fucking Hitler. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. No. Well, that was unexpected, but hey, fucking scientist who's a fucking psychopath, yeah, who'd have fucking thought they'd fucking worship fucking Hitler? Oh, I just want ammo. Oh, that's. That's a big no no. Okay, um, ammo. Jesus Christ. Because I'm not fighting the fucking. that big boy. 
And I'm not fighting uh, a cougar. I don't even know if they're fucking cougar ladies or jaguar ladies anymore. I'm not fighting them with a fucking knife. Not at all. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, the that doctor boss with the syringes that I chainsawed that you can hit stun. You can no longer hit stun, I don't think. Um, so he's much harder now, too. But... Uh, he, he's definitely alive, so we'll be running in him probably at some point. Let's see if I can get into this. But, okay. Fucking... What? 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 <laughs> Fucking hate you. Now, oh, come on. Is this one blocked off as well, or is it just shitty jumping? I think this is blocked off too. Like all the secret vent areas that I could get to before. Either that or I'm just doing really shitty jumps. Feels like it's just far enough away that I can't do it. Oh, never mind. Here we go. Well, or. No, it's blocked off. Or. I just really can't do any vent jumps, like seriously. I'm holding crouch, I'm in the middle of it. Fuck it, I guess. Just can't do it, so I'm just gonna assume it's impossible. Alright, now we're on the other side of here. But, is there anything I missed? Um... No. Five secrets to find. Oh man, um, I just have so little ammo. It's ridiculous. I'm gonna assume that's maybe the point. But I'm like desperate for ammo. Maybe the World War fucking two bunker in the bottom would have shit in it. I can't go back to the fucking. Hitler room until I find some ammo that can take down the cougar lady. Like, at least one box of shotgun ammo. Fuck, another one of those fuckers? Shotgun. But we need the shotgun. Well, we could use a pistol on the wall guy, but we have 30 bullets. There should be ammo in this direction, though, so we'll keep going. Shotgun, though, three rounds. We need three for the Jaguar Lady, Max. Hopefully there aren't crazy enemies here. Hell yeah. Okay, that's good. More shit, that's nice. And let's see. Wait. There we go. Well, our first was. Wait. I can't get down there. I can't even set off the trap by shooting them. Interesting. Well, at least we don't have to worry about censorship because of the uh, horrible violence. Also, we're not going to go in the doctor's room for obvious reasons, but either the poison actually- well, maybe we could check because it didn't kill us by walking in there. I'm curious. But we'll just be full of poison. floor is full of toxic gas. I cannot go there without some protection. Yep. 
Oh boy, like I'd want to go back in here. I don't have the ammo. I don't have anything. I'd at least need... I don't even know if Chainsaw would work well on him anymore, since of the lack of a stun lock. And up here, we don't need to go, because we've been up there. It just has the big boy in the chapel area. And I don't have enough ammo for him. He'd be a bullet sponge. I'd have to save it too and see if I could maybe cheese him with a knife, maybe? Who knows? Wrong way. Get back uh, to the Hitler room. My oh, bitch is close, goddamn. Seven bolts for pistol and ten for shotgun. We should be good for a short while. Seriously, though, Hitler. Block. I don't think we can go on the other side of that. Hitler. But yeah, never use bullets on these guys. If the whole expansion is meant to be hard via not giving you much ammo. Mm. Then yeah, you're gonna have to be... Well, that's weirdly shaped now, ain't it? Oh yeah. So this is completely new area. Hello, doggo. Two doggo. Shotgun? No. Oh. oh. Not you. Hmm. Okay. Still fine. I wonder where I'm going to be putting the bomb. More fucking Hitler. That bitch. <laughs> She's wearing underwear, thank God. Yeah, sup. Thank god I ran perfectly behind, right through this slim fucking doorway. <laughs> just, she's, just, she's got a, let's just say she's got a butt plug that has a cross coming out, I'm sure. Hmm, where the fuck am I? More fucking Hitler rooms. Ah! Oh god! Hey, that was all of a s fucking sudden. Fuck, that was... It's like, where the fuck was he hiding the entire fucking time? I can't deal with him. I went to his fucking Nazi appreciation room and pissed him off, apparently. Well, we can't deal with him. Yeah, he's coming, okay. And he's fast. Like, remind, like the red, the red stone just makes me think of fucking Wolfenstein. All right, how far must I run away from him? Is that? Well, that's nice. At least he doesn't follow me that fucking far. That'd have been problematic if he kept following me. It's giving me like like this. The game is like a. The first game is Resident Evil Two. This is Resident Evil Three. We have to deal with Nemesis, but it's just no one's busting through walls like the Kool Aid Man. Um. So we didn't go in the gas room now. I'm going to... Fuck me. I want to check the basement area. Like, the underground. We have a bomb now, for one thing. But we have two shots. Oh boy. We can go in the gas room. The doctor's room, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Um... 
you're always low on ammo. So, like, in the in the original game, you either had a lot of ammo, or you, then you used it all and were really low on ammo. Overabundance or under... Un underabundance? Not enough or too much. But now, it just feels like I'm always on the brink of not having enough. I don't know, I wouldn't even want to know how hard it would be on the hard difficulty. But yeah, I'm gonna see if I can get ammo in the... The bunker. It would make sense, honestly. If you could get a lot of ammo. I haven't been drinking much of my coffee. Alright. Oh. Let's see. There's one bitch gardening it. As long as there's no birds. Come on. Oh, no. I did hear the flappers. Oh, I wasn't wrong. Oh, run, 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 run. Zigzag too. Just ignore them. Oh. Mm -hmm. Hello, moi. Ha ha ha. Mmm, 400 bullets too. Oh boy. Alright. What we got down here? I'm feeling a little better now. We got this baby with us again. Such a nice, loud, very loud gun. Unless they toned down the audio. Oh, they're all here. Wonder if. <sighs> nice try. Save points here. Oh, fuck it. Uh, we have three saves still. I'm curious. So Wonderful face, isn't it? It's good. It's good for thumbnail material, you know. Anyways, um, let's see if the stone wall is actually down still. There'd be no reason why it wouldn't be. It is. See, I want to know what's there. It's bugged me for so long, and there are keys there in the first game. But shit. I mean, it technically should all be buried. You shouldn't be able to get through. Might as well take a little peek. I'd imagine it would be closed off, though. If this was a way to get outside, too, that'd be- Oh, God. <coughs> fucking hate. I did not like fucking dealing with these. Yeah, It's closed off, as far as I can tell. Oh, at least no weird body here. Well, nope. that's it. Nothing here. There is that fucking ladder, though, that we never found out where that comes from or where it goes. But it's gonna forever remain a mystery. Let's figure out what's... I guess down the rest of the sewers. I can consider it that a good enough episode in terms of length. Because it's dangerous. Flying bears are also dangerous, but... The amount of times they were around the corner jaguars were quite a lot. Oh, lantern! Oh, lantern! Oh, thank you. We actually... Yeah. Really? You hit me? We have a fucking light source. Hmm, hmm surprising. Mmm. Mmm. Tasty. Well, so far, this adventure has been uh, into the sewer area. Has been wor really worthwhile. The explosion, though. There was that place. Like, is this where I can find the explosive? I couldn't find the explosive device for that crack in the wall where the boss first was. The boss 
actually shouldn't be dead. It was still moving. It... It could still be fucking around. Wow. I don't like the looks of his head. That looks like a lot of shotguns. I'm climbing up the ladder. I don't... Hmm. I want to find out... Because I, there definitely was, like, a place in the monster cave to use the explosive in the first game. At least that's what the developer implied to me. So it's not like the explosive device for the crack in the wall was saved for the expansion sort of thing. I just never found the explosive to use. Ah. But, um... Hmm, you know what? Let's leave it here. <laughs> I want to explore the rest, but not when I saw such an obstacle such as those big fatties. Yeah, it looked like it had like six shotguns attached to his fucking head. We can save that for another time. Yeah. So, I hope you enjoy and look forward to more, where I will explore, I guess, the poison gas room. Which should probably be where we go first. When I, re when I begin the game again, I'll go outside, painstakingly have to deal with those flying bears, hopefully quickly. And then go into the gas room, find out what ammo and stuff I can find there, because it's a dead end room, and hopefully the doctor doesn't get in my way. Um, and then we'll, uh, re I guess, re-explore the caverns, because I don't have a tool for cutting the chains to get into the basement. But we have a bomb, which will likely be used in the caves, and uh, I guess try to escape in a similar pathway as the main character, perhaps. Not sure. But I hope you enjoyed and look forward to more of Dismantled, Bittersweet Misery, or the expansion. If you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment, hit the subscribe button, become a full subscriber, and the notification down below for updates of my videos. Thank you for watching, and until the next time. Rum.